welcome back to my channel. If you would like to see how I made this look with drugstore makeup, please stay tuned. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, I'm Ellie. Nice to meet you. And for everyone else, thank you for being here, spending some time with me today. So guys, my channel is a little bit of everything. I love to unbox subscription boxes. I love to do makeup and beauty, health, wellness. I love to do a lot of things on my channel. So today we are going to be making a whole face look, whole face tutorial on drugstore makeup. And it's mainly going to be elf products, but I'm going to have to incorporate some things that are drugstore related that are elf. So the first thing is I finally got my hands on Poreless Putty Primer, Universal Sheer with Hydration. Okay, so there it is, cruelty free and vegan of course. This is the putty primer that Jeffree Star approved and said it was actually really good. So I want to try this. I'm super excited. So do you guys like e.l.f.? Tell me down below. I like e.l.f. a lot. I think e.l.f. is one of the better makeup brands that is drugstore related. I know they just had a sale of 60% off. Like a lot of things. So this is what it looks like. So let's try this out. Ooh, it's nice and creamy. You know, you can apply this with your fingers or actually a makeup brush, too. It's very nice and soft and smooth. It applies on nicely. I'm very shocked. Make sure we get underneath those eyes. So we'll see how good this does with the foundation and the concealer and everything. But it does say to wait like, I think it was three minutes before you apply your foundation. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to pause this and I'll be right back. I went ahead and I actually used a green corrector because I do have some redness on my face right now. I have a couple spots. So I wanted to cover that up and here is the kind well, the green corrector. Green takes out red. So, the foundation has sunscreen in it. It's FPF 15. That's pretty good. Okay. So, this is in the shade Light Ivory. Here it is. It's in glass, it's nice. So I'm gonna apply it to my brush, like a bookie brush, and let's see how we do. I know it looks a little streaky, guys, but I do have my Huda Beauty, Beauty sponge right here, so I always go over it. I'm really hoping this primer works really well. Why you gotta be afraid? I wish I could make you stay. Cause baby, I love you. Why you trying to break us up? I do have a red mark right there. It's from sleeping. An indent from my pillowcase. It just hasn't worn off yet today. <laughs> Take a sponge to this. And I do have concealer as well. The camo concealer is almost gone, but we're gonna use that as well. This beauty sponge is amazing. I love it. 
it's hotter beauty. So how can you not? I'll tell you, looking at it so far, it seems like the primer is working really good. Let's put some camo on. Get rid of some darkness. And this is in the shade Fair Warm. Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight. I'm gonna miss your body. You know I can never get it right without you. No, I don't wanna step in. Has anyone tried her beauty blender? It's magical. So guys, I am giving this primer an Allie approved as well because this is some really good primer. It is not showing my pores really at all. You guys look. God, that end up driving me crazy from sleeping on a Okay, now we're gonna bake because I do have some setting powder from them in Soft Luminous. I think guys, all this stuff together, I will put the prices of everything down below, but I think the foundation was like $8. I know the primer was $8 yesterday when I bought it. Um, I don't know how much everything is, so I will put the prices in for you guys. So how's everyone doing? I hope everyone's doing grand. Spring is here, so that makes me happy. I love nice weather. All right, let's start baking. Their products are really good. I highly recommend, if you have not used e.l.f., Go try them out. Give them a chance. I love the setting powder. So I do not have an eyebrow product from them, so I do actually have to use a non-drugstore. I don't think it's in drugstores at all. I actually I do have an yes I do have one it's Maybelline Tattoo Studios this stuff is amazing for your eyebrows and this of course is in brow pomade light blonde This stuff is so good. And you don't need much of the product either. Just a little more. Okay. Now I'm going to use a brow setter. And let me see what kinds I have. I only think, oh boy. Okay, so I'm gonna use Benefit Cosmetics, which I don't know if it's in drugstores or like Target yet, but I don't think it is. But this stuff is amazing. I'm 
sorry I'm sniffling guys. My allergies are terrible because New York can't figure out if spring wants to be here or if it doesn't because I woke up this morning, yesterday it was like 62 degrees and this morning it's like 30 something and there was snow on cars and on top of the roof there was like snow and I wasn't thrilled about that but whatever. Okay, so next we are actually, I'm going to move on to my eyes. I want to do my eyes. Or should we finish the face? Okay, let me think. So we're going to do the eyes. I just want to do the eyes. I want to play with eyeshadow palette. It's new. Um, it's the bit size eyeshadow and it's rose water. It's really pretty. And this time it didn't come with no, nothing in it. Last time I got one there, I don't know if you guys watched one of my makeup videos, but prior I got an e.l.f. palette and it had like this black stuff in it and it looked like a spider. It was scary. There we go. Let's see if we can open this. Oh. We had an accident. My nail went right into the eyeshadow. That's all right. All right, so obviously we're gonna start with this color right here. I already primed my eyes. I had to use uh, Pretty Vulgar. That's the only, well, that's the closest thing to drugstore makeup I have. So, let's grab a nice brush. Here we go. It's a very light color. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm seeing it. Great transition color. I like it. This is a really great palette. I love the colors, and it's one of those palettes that you can just throw in your purse. Oh, it's great for traveling. That's what I love about these little palettes that they came out with. All right. So the next color I'm going to go on to with, I'm going to use this color right here. And let's see how that goes. It's a shimmer. I'm having a little fallout, but I think that's my own fault. I think I put a little too much. On the brush. You know I can never get it right without you. No, I don't wanna step into the light. If I don't get you shoddy, you bring out the sweetness of my life. Oh yeah. Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good loving. Come on and show me that, show me that, show me that you're the one. I Beautiful. So the next color I'm going to use is this dark color right here because I want to darken up my corners. These eyeshadows are working really nice. So let's see how this dark shadow works because last time it was a little patchy, but right, we'll see. We're going very light with it. We're not gonna go heavy with it. Baby, I do. Baby, I do. Oh, yeah. Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good love. Come on and show me that, show me that, show me that you're the one. I move to the left while you move to the right. That looks nice. Give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that. Give me that, give me that, give me that. Give me that, give me that, give me that. 
Okay, we have one more color to use, and that is the one I stuck my finger in. That color right there. Ooh, this is the pretty color. I really like this color a lot. This color is really nice and it's a nice highlight. It's a shimmer, but it, if you look at the eye, it's really, yeah, bringing it out. Beautiful. I love this palette. Really nice palette. Great eye look for three dollars. You cannot go wrong. This palette, Rosewater, was it called? What was it called? Yeah, Rosewater. This is three dollars, guys. I know that for a fact. So next, we gotta get some mascara going. The mascara I'm gonna use is from Maybelline New York Sky High. I love this mascara. It's great. If you guys have not tried it, go get it. I think it's $11.99, if I remember correctly. It works. You know what, I gotta curl my eyelashes first. We gotta do that. I got that stop. So is anybody celebrating Easter? I love Easter. Easter has always been one of my favorite holidays. I love Easter baskets and I'm making a few Easter baskets for a few people. It's crazy. Easter's gonna be here in three days. difference this really brings your eyelashes up and if you have natural beautiful eyelashes yeah this mascara works great it really gives you that length and volume so you really don't have to wear falsies but I like to wear falsies I'm going to be using some eyeliner and I'm trying to think what eyeliners I have that are right here available. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go for my milk makeup. And this is great because you can smudge it. It's got a smudger. I love milk makeup products. I don't know about you guys, but I do. I highly recommend this eyeliner. Long wear gel eyeliner. I'm trying to see what shade I have. It's not telling me what shade I have, guys. Sorry. I think I'm going to do my top lid, too. So I'll be We're right. going to work on the face now. And the closest thing I have to like a drugstore-related contour is Beauty Creations Contour. And I won this in a giveaway. I've never used it. So here are the shades. 
So we're going to contour with those. And I think it's gonna work out great, actually. So let me grab my handy contour brush and let's get going. I'm gonna go in with soft brown first. Oh, there's a mirror, I think. Is there a plastic thing on it? That's weird. It's supposed to be a mirror, guys, but look, you can't see anything out. Wow, that's weird. Okay. This isn't a bad shade. Beauty Creations, I haven't used very much of their makeup, to be honest, so this is all new to me. I love trying out new makeup. I just hope this doesn't look too orange. I'm using the shade that's like the closest to my contour that I normally use. I normally use Too Faced con um, cover contour, but I'm really liking this. All right, on to blush. So blush, I do have a drugstore blush. And that is by Elme. And this is 200 So Peachy. And there it is. It's a beautiful color. All right, let's start blushing it up. I love blush. If you know me, I love blush. Beautiful. A little bit of your nose. Just a little bit. Got a nice glowing face. Almost. We gotta do highlight. <clears throat> So I have a few options for highlight for drugstore and I want to use this because I just bought this and this is called Star Lux. I don't know if anyone's seen this yet from Wet n Wild, but I do want to try it out and see how it, how it works. So let's try this highlight out. It is pretty golden, but I want to try it out. This is more for the summer, but I like it. Let's try it. And I have my lucky brush. She Crafty gave this to me a long time ago. I love Tracy. She's amazing. If you guys do not know who She Crafty is, go check her out. Wow, this is gorgeous. Just a little bit. Look at that, guys. It is glowing. Love it. Just a little bit on the chin. And let me clean up my eyes because my eyes have been watering. And we're going to do a lippy and then we're done. I forgot to use setting spray, but I am so lucky. I found L setting spray. So let's set our face. Make sure it looks okay. Ooh, it's got a weird smell to it. I don't like that. It's not old or anything, guys. 
It's in clear, by the way. And then I found one of my elf lippies, and it's a lip crayon, and I love them. What color is this? Neutral, six, all these numbers. Now I'm gonna use my lip liner to make it pop out. <clears throat> and this is from Thrive Cosmetics, or Cosmetics, excuse me. And this is lip folder, lip liner, in khaki. All right guys, we're almost done with our look. I think we're done completely. So tell me down below, what do you guys think about this look? Do you think it came out okay, considering it was all drugstore makeup? I think it came out really good. Except my eye won't stop watering. I can't control that. <laughs> so guys, if you like this video, can you like, comment, subscribe, and follow me over on Instagram at Ellie's Magical Insights, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight.